All right, so when I get up in the morning, I wake up from the alarm on my phone and then I just kind of go on my phone, check my messages and stuff. I've been trying not to go on my phone for as much, but honestly, I'm not very good at it. I definitely need to get better. And then I just make my bed. It's always really good to make your bed in the morning because it means you've already achieved one task for the day and it can just help you to have a really productive day for the rest of the day. And then I go and put some music on. Um, right now I'm just playing the new Arctic Monkeys album. I absolutely love this album, especially the second side. Um, yeah, I know a lot of people don't like it, but I really love it. I don't always play music on my record player, like I'll play it off my laptop and stuff sometimes. Um, but this morning I did my record player. And now I'm just preparing um, some lemon water. So I saw my housemate doing this and I was like, that's a really good idea. <laughs> so I get up in the morning and I have a hot lemon water. And this is really good to help kick your immune system off for the day. It's really, really good for your skin and um, yeah, digestion. So I always do that first thing in the morning. Um, also because I'm not really hungry when I first wake up. And it honestly doesn't taste that great, but it's worth it. And then I just cleanse any dirt um, off my skin from the night before with my face halo. I'm not going to clean my face yet because I'm actually going to do a little at home workout, which I'll show you guys in a second. Now I'm doing my workout. As you guys can see, I have this wrap on my leg because I was doing F45 and I screwed up my knee. And I'm really upset about it because I now can't do F45 anymore. So it means I can't do any exercises um, that involve my legs. So this morning, I'm just gonna be doing a couple of exercises at home um, for my upper body, um, but not anything for my look. This is so funny for me to watch. <laughs> I've never seen myself exercise before. Keep in mind guys, I'm literally the most beginner person ever at workouts. I do like yoga and Pilates sometimes, but this kind of stuff I've never done before. So please don't judge me if I'm doing these wrong. And then I died. Yep. Dead. Now I'm just gonna have a shower um, and I'm gonna use my body wash and then I'm gonna use my Sukin face cleanser. I absolutely love this because it's so affordable and it's just a really good cleanser for every day. And I just know that there's so nasties in it. So yeah, just gonna cleanse um, my face and then use my Clinique Moisture Surge. As you guys can see, I'm almost out of this. I absolutely love this moisturizer so much. It is the best moisturizer I've ever tried in my life and I'll continue to use it probably indefinitely to be honest. Quickly gonna show you guys what I do with my makeup when like I'm literally not doing anything crazy for the day. Like if I'm going to work and I just want something really simple or I just don't feel like putting makeup on. Um, the first thing I use is the Napoleon Pettis Auto Pilot Skin Primer. This stuff is amazing. I use it every single day, like regardless of what I'm doing. I just use the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and it doesn't really matter what shade I use this in because I put it on before. I put my foundation on just to cover up. I've got a fair bit of scarring on my chin here. It sucks when your skin gets better, but then like have all the scarring left. But it's better than having like active pimples, so I'm not complaining. So I'm going shopping with my friends today. And um, one of the things I need to buy is a beauty blender because my other one is like just disgusting. So I'm gonna be applying my makeup today with a brush, which I really don't ever do, ever. But for that, sorry, I keep touching my hair, but I just want to get it out of my face. So the foundations that I use, I mix two together, is the L'Oreal Infallible Glow Foundation and the Rimmel Lasting Finish Breathable Foundation. These are both amazing for every day. They're honestly the best drugstore foundations ever. If there's any two foundations I can recommend from the drugstore, it is these two. And I mix them together just because I'm a little bit fake tanned at the moment. And this one is too light and this one is too dark, obviously. And then I usually take a beauty blender, but i to use a brush today, peeps. Then I'm using the Lasting Perfection Collection 2000 Concealer just under my eyes. I don't know if you can get this in Australia. I bought it when I was in London. And it is so cheap and so freaking good. Like, if you guys are going to London, you need to get that concealer. It's so good. I've been really loving quite like a dewy finish lately. So whilst I do set my face, I don't do it a lot. I just kind of like do my T-zone. And you can use any transparent powder ever. Um, for my eyebrows, I just take my favorite eyebrow pencil ever. This is the Precisely My Brow by Benefit. And I just brush through them. And I create a line under my brow. 
and then I just use the spoolie to comb it through and that's literally all I do apart from brow wax and that actually got talked to me by um, Hannah who's the brow, National Brow Artist for Benefit Australia she does my brows and that's how she taught me to do my brows so yeah I've been loving it I've been doing it for like the past few months I don't know why I just did one eyebrow and now I'm doing the other one I never do that but um just do the other one and that is literally everything I've been doing for every day like work and stuff and I just kind of couldn't be bothered putting heaps of makeup on today so that is what I do for my makeup now let's go I feel I was looking in the viewfinder the whole time I'm so sorry guys I haven't filmed in so long um, but now I'm gonna go make breakfast and bring you guys along with me of course so here I'm just making my daily smoothie I have a smoothie every single day because I absolutely love them and I just put in one banana some spinach some frozen blueberries a little bit of acai powder and the lean protein from Topeka I usually do all almond milk, but I was running a little bit low this morning, so I did half almond milk and half water. I absolutely love having a smoothie every single day because you can just fit so much goodness in there and it still tastes delicious. And it fills me up for really long when I put in the protein powder, so that's really good. And then I usually just take that on the go with me to work, but this morning I'm going shopping with my friends, so I just took it in the car. I don't know what I'm doing right now. <laughs> then I also take some supplements, um, zinc, which is really good for your skin, magnesium, which is really good for your muscles, turmeric, which is also really good for your skin, and iron because I'm iron deficient. Fun fact, I actually can't swallow pills by themselves, so I need to eat them with food to trick my mind into thinking that I'm swallowing food. It's super weird. Any of you guys have the same issue, please let me know in the comments. That is everything. I'm just wearing this Glasson's shirt and ASOS jumper, and I'm going to head shopping. Bye! I would like to get to know if